Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Today we are doing a what I eat in a day pregnancy edition. I've already gotten a bit of a late start to this video because it is currently 11 18 and I'm just now pulling out the camera. I haven't really eaten a whole lot so far today. I had some oatmeal with peanut butter as you guys know I always do that. Um, Everly stay close and I'm actually just now drinking my coffee, so it's been a little bit of a rough day. It's going better now that we're outside. What? Here's Miss Everly. Everly, say hi. Hi. What you doing? I'm reading the book. Oh. Okay. Okay. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> She's picking flowers and putting them in her little chalk container um but it's been a little bit of a rough day because everly um i'm not really weaning her off of her binky just more trying to get her ah. not to want it all the time I. okay I. yeah just stay close okay um so after i stopped okay bye bye so after I stopped nursing Everly, she got very, very attached to the binky. Um, she's always been attached, but it just like became, she needed it 24 seven when I stopped nursing her. And I get that cause it's like a comfort thing and everything. And I kind of was being very lenient with it because of the move and just all the changes that were going on. I felt like that was something that was consistent and just something, you know, for her just to have security in. But it's just gotten to the point where she just thinks she needs it all the time. And so I'm just trying to let her not need it 24-7, you know what I'm saying? Because I know that's not good for her teeth and just it will make it a lot easier when we do wean her off completely. Because I just know with Truett coming, he's going to take binkies and so, well maybe, I mean, I don't know that for sure, but we're gonna let him have binkies. I know every parent is so different when it comes to how they feel about the pacifier. Hi! Hi! You're oh. so stinking cute. Yeah, see ya. But since I do breastfeed, it just makes it, it just helps a lot with them being able to soothe themselves. And I know it helps, it also helps with safe sleep when they are little little to have a binky in their mouth so um i don't know i just see there's just positives and negatives to everything and right now we're you know she's just about two so getting to that stage where she doesn't need it all the time but i mean obviously she's not going to take a binky the rest of her life so it's fine <laughs> But yeah, that's just kind of been our morning and she's in a much better mood now that we're outside. That seriously always changes everything. Bath and outside will just change the mood entirely. But yeah, so we're gonna hang out here for a little bit longer since it is already just about 11.30. Um, and then we'll go in and I'll catch back up when we eat some lunch, which will probably be around noon, so. This video is what I eat in a day, but it's gonna probably end up being a lot of a vlog as well. So, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. <laughs> Hi, you wanna see yourself? Yeah. Who's that girl? You wanna hold it? Okay. Okay, you gotta be really careful, okay? Happy, I'm gonna see. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. Puppy. Oh, you're telling them that there's puppies over there? There are puppies over there, aren't there? Mm -hmm. You love puppies, huh? And 
We had family over for Easter and we had so much food. So we're pretty much just eating leftovers off of that. But I made myself a chicken sandwich, like a rotisserie chicken with this bread. I love this bread, it's so good. And then some deviled eggs. And then this is, I love these drinks, these bay drinks. They're so good, so refreshing. I drink one of these like every day, so. That is for lunch and I'm freaking starving and I have to scarf this down because I only have so much time with this little one. So lunch is now all cleaned up and I wanted to take a second while Everly is content, she's just down here coloring, to update you guys a little bit. This mommy, mommy. What, baby? Do you want to do a color? Yeah, we're not going to color with these ones. Okay, listen to mommy. You can color with these ones, but you have to sit beside mommy. Okay. Okay. Here. Here's these. Would you like, which color would you like? All of them. <laughs> okay. She's getting really good at her colors, aren't you? What color is that? Orange. Orange? No. <laughs> good job. What color is this? Orange. No. Do you want me to open it for you? Look, I have to open it. What color is this? Red. No, what color is this? Blue. No, what color is this? Red. Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> I swear she's getting good at it. <laughs> Here. You just proved me wrong, kid. I was just trying to brag on you. <gasps> there you go. Two. Beautiful. Um, but anyway, so I'm just going to update you guys a little bit on my pregnancy and how it's been going. <laughs> I was watching the first clip back <laughs> from this video and I look so tired and that is just the reality. I've been struggling so bad the last few days with um, sleep insomnia and not the fact that I'm like uncomfortable or anything. I mean... Mommy. Granted, I am because I'm pregnant Mommy. and I don't think that's ever going to change, yeah. but pink. Pink. Um, but I think I'm just like, I'm going to be eight months pregnant Saturday and I have just this really good feeling that this baby is going to be early. I don't think he's going to be crazy early, but I do. I would be so surprised if I go to my due date. And so I'm just now thinking of everything that I still need to do. And it's just, it's keeping me up at night. I cannot sleep. I just lay there for hours. So it makes me very tired throughout the day. Um, I take naps as much as I can, but last night I actually was up really late working on- Mommy, um, Mommy. Yes, thank you. On a checklist for my diaper bag. I was just thinking maybe this is something I can do to make me feel like I'm preparing. That seemed to help a little bit. I have a checklist now for myself. Still need to do one for baby, but. And I also, at my next appointment, which is this week, I need to talk mommy, to my doctor. Mommy. Thank you. I need to talk to my doctor about um, just like their protocol, like, especially with COVID and stuff. I don't know how that's going to be because I know in Texas, all the restrictions have been lifted so they stay which is fine but i just want to know how that's gonna be when i give birth like is it just gonna be only me and tj allowed there in there um during delivery or even after delivery can i bring everly to the hospital after i have him i just don't know just lots of thoughts and I know everything's gonna work out and everything's gonna be fine. I mean, but it just keeps me up at night and it makes me so tired. Mm. Mm. This one good? Mm. This one strawberries? Yeah. Oh! Hey, <laughs> Tay. Hey, Tay. Yeah. No. Don't you nerds? Yeah. Mmm, delicious. I 
Careful, baby. Look how big these strawberries are. These strawberries are huge. Look at that. <laughs> that is a big old strawberry, huh? Should we cut them up? now around three Everly and I actually ended up taking a nap and now we're gonna eat a little snack we're gonna run a few errands after this I'm really not very hungry but I know I'm going to get hungry so I'm going to eat some fruit and I'll probably bring like a granola bar or something with me too because I always get so hungry when we're out and about and then I just get in a bad mood and so to avoid that, that's what I do. What are you eating? Daddy's <laughs> She's just like munching on the cheese. Where are you going? Yeah, so Daddy went to Sonic and got some mozzarella sticks, so obviously I had to eat them. I mean, it's not even a question. You can go bye bye now. Mm -hmm. Say bye to Daddy. Bye bye bye. Have fun. They love you. Love you. <laughs> okay, let's go. So we are home now. Let me get my camera situated. Have you had a little bit of a meltdown in the car? She got really sad because she dropped her baby and mommy couldn't reach back to get it. But we're okay now. <laughs> so, um, I look like a hot mess. <laughs> but I want to show you guys, I'll just go ahead and show you guys a few things that I got. I didn't get much, but um, I did find these sheets at Ross. Ross, if you don't know, it's kind of like a TJ Maxx, I would say, I guess. They just have a bunch of different things for a discounted price. And I found these sheets, this this sheet sets. It comes with a fitted sheet, a flat sheet, and four pillowcases. <laughs> We're just sad right now. We're just sad, huh? It was only $21.99, so I couldn't pass that up. Because somehow I got bleach all over our new pillowcases and our sheets and those ones were $50 so kind of sad about that but Truett has the hiccups right now I can feel them um, and then the last thing that I got from Ross was this kind of big but hopefully I can show you are these like wicker basket type things and I'm planning to put this above our bed I've been on the hunt for something like this to go above our bed and this one was only 25 dollars so really really good deal and then i also went to a store called tuesday morning and that one's kind of the same thing <laughs> i guess but i didn't get a whole lot there i got some more another organizer thing for our bathroom and then everly needed some washcloths for her bathroom so got a few washcloths and then lastly, I found this little $5 bubble machine. Everly is obsessed with bubbles and hopefully this works, but it wears me out constantly <laughs> blowing bubbles. So yeah. I thought this would be fun. Okay. Yeah, wouldn't that be fun? It's bubbles. Yeah, we'll do this outside. Yeah, so I am now going to be making some dinner. We're doing a Taco Tuesday, and it's already past 5 o'clock, so I need to get on that. <laughs> Hopefully these crackers will hold you over, huh? Okay, to start off with the tacos, I'm super basic, and we just get this Mexican-style uh, rice for my Cerrone, some 
ground beef and then I just used a great value taco seasoning. So here's the setup. We got our guacamole, corn, tomato, cheese, salsa, and then these chips, hint of lime. They are the best. So good. And then over here, you have your rice and your beef. Okay, so here is what the final result looks like. This is seriously so stinking good. It pretty much just mix everything in together and voila. Here's Evie. Evie approves too. She loves her chips and salsa. She likes everything separated. Right? No more. No more. Okay. Daddy, no more. More? You have some have some. right there. <laughs> what are you talking about? And now to end the day, a lovely glass of milk to help my terrible heartburn. I notice if I eat anything like Mexican or anything super carby <laughs> I will get or spicy really anything citrusy I'll get heartburn doesn't really matter what it is to be honest but if I go ahead and drink a glass of milk with whatever I'm eating it does tend to help so gotta do that not gonna lie I'll probably end up having another snack <laughs> during the middle of the night just kind of what I do, but I'll insert a clip if that ends up happening. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll hopefully see you in my next one. Bye, guys.